Hello MotoGP enthusiasts! Welcome back to ZNGP today. As for today's highlights, new footage from the Sepping MotoGP test captures a candid conversation between Marc Marquez and Francesco Bagnaia, offering insights into Marquez's adjustment to the Ducati. As Marquez embarks on his journey with Gresini Racing, leaving behind his tenure at Repsol Honda, his interaction with Bagnaia sheds light on the challenges and nuances of transitioning to a new bike. Let's delve into the details of their exchange and its implications for Marquez's upcoming season. Marc Marquez, drawing parallels between his own career in MotoGP and Fernando Alonso's in Formula One, shares insights into the mindset of the Spanish racing legend. From aggression on track to respecting rivals, Marquez acknowledges the influence of Alonso's approach to competition. Alberto Puig, HRC team manager, discusses Honda's commitment to enhancing their MotoGP performance for the 2024 season. With a focus on improving power, reducing weight, and strengthening collaboration with LCR Honda, Puig sheds light on Honda's strategy to close the gap to their competitors. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell icon to be able to update other news with CNGP today. At the Sepping test, Marquez engaged in a revealing conversation with Banyaya, providing a glimpse into his experience with the Ducati GP23. Banyaya's inquiry about the bike's handling prompts Marquez to acknowledge the differences between the Ducati and his former Honda. Despite his proficiency with the Honda, Marquez admits to grappling with the Ducati's characteristics, particularly in optimizing time attacks. Marquez's remarks underscore the intricacies of adapting to the Ducati's riding dynamics, emphasizing the need to refine his approach for optimal performance. While acknowledging the stability and endurance of the Ducati, Marquez identifies challenges in mastering its responsiveness during time attacks. His commitment to understanding and optimizing his riding style reflects a strategic approach to navigating the learning curve associated with his new bike. With the preseason Qatar test on the horizon, Marquez's conversation with Banyaya offers valuable insights as he prepares to enter his first race weekend with Gresini Racing. Despite the adjustments and learning curve, Marquez remains optimistic about his prospects on the Ducati, leveraging his experience and resilience to overcome challenges. As rivals anticipate his competitive debut, Marquez's dedication to fine-tuning his Ducati sets the stage for an intriguing season ahead. Marc Marquez's candid exchange with Francesco Bagnaia provides a revealing glimpse into his transition to the Ducati GP23 and his preparations for the upcoming MotoGP season with Gresini Racing. As Marquez navigates the nuances of his new bike and fine-tunes his approach, his commitment to overcoming challenges and optimizing performance sets the stage for an exciting chapter in his illustrious career. With the support of his team and rivals' acknowledgement of his potential, Marquez's journey promises to captivate fans and redefine his legacy in MotoGP. Marquez highlights the importance of understanding rivals' strengths rather than belittling them, citing Alonso's approach to competition as a valuable lesson. Despite their aggressive racing styles, both Marquez and Alonso emphasize respect for teammates and rivals, both on and off the track. Marquez and Alonso recognize the competitive nature of their respective championships and the technical factors influencing performance. While acknowledging the role of machinery in Formula One, Marquez appreciates Alonso's skill in overtaking, highlighting his ability to make daring moves on the track. Marquez reflects on his career-threatening injuries and the challenges of returning to MotoGP. He emphasizes the importance of managing expectations and remaining realistic about his goals, both professionally and personally. Marquez's decision to switch to Gresini Ducati reflects careful consideration and a desire for a new challenge. One of the things that Fernando taught me is that you don't have to belittle your rival, but with respect. 
What happens in Formula 1 is that it depends a lot on the car. But it will never lose that magic of those overtakes that are different. You have to escape expectations when you come back from an injury. There has to be a path drawn, Marquez told to DeZone. Mark Marc Marquez's insights into his relationship with Fernando Alonso offer a glimpse into the mindset of two Spanish racing icons. From learning valuable lessons about competition and respect to navigating career challenges, Marquez's journey in MotoGP continues to be shaped by the wisdom gleaned from his peers and experiences on and off the track. As he prepares for the upcoming season with Grezzini Ducati, Marquez remains focused on his path forward, drawing inspiration from the lessons learned along the way. Puig highlights Honda's progress in improving power and reducing the weight of their MotoGP bike addressing key areas of focus for the 2024 season. While acknowledging positive strides in performance, Puig identifies the need to enhance stability during long runs, emphasizing this as a primary objective for upcoming tests. Puig discusses the strengthened collaboration between the factory Honda team and LCR Honda, emphasizing the importance of leveraging resources and supporting experienced riders like Johan Zarco. With increased involvement and shared resources, Puig aims to maximize the benefits of the concessions granted to Honda. Puig acknowledges the valuable feedback provided by new riders like Luca Marini, emphasizing Marini's methodical approach and clear communication style. Marini's transition from Ducati to Honda brings valuable insights that contribute to the ongoing development of the RC213D, highlighting the significance of rider input in refining the bike's performance. The steps we have made are positive, now we have to make the bike more stable in the race. We put in more resources, and we have to utilize the concession as much as possible. He is very methodical, his comments are very clear," Puig told Marca. Alberto Puig's insights into Honda's efforts to improve their MotoGP performance offer a glimpse into the strategic initiatives driving the team forward in the 2024 season. With a focus on performance enhancements, collaboration with LCR Honda, and leveraging the expertise of new riders like Luca Marini, Honda aims to address key areas of improvement and compete at the highest level in the upcoming MotoGP Championship. Thanks for watching ZNGP today. See you in the next information about MotoGP news update.